Hi guys, welcome to Media Tutor. Today we are going to discuss the most important current affairs topics of the year 2020. The Norwegian Academy of Science and Letters has decided to award the Abel Prize for 2020 to Hillel Fersenberg, Hebrew University of Jerusalem, Israel and Gregory Margulis, Yale University, New Haven, USA. The Abel Prize was established on 1 January 2002. The purpose is to award the Abel Prize for outstanding scientific work in the field of mathematics. The prize is awarded by the Norwegian Academy of Science and Letters, which has appointed an Abel Committee consisting of five mathematicians to review the nominated candidates and submit a recommendation for a worthy Abel Laureate. India ranked 77th on a sustainability index that takes into account per capita carbon emissions and 131st on a flourishing ranking that measures the best chance at survival and well-being for children, according to a report commissioned by the World Health Organization WHO, UN Children's Fund UNICEF, and the Lancet Medical Journal. The 13th session of the Conference of the Parties to the Convention on the Conservation of Migratory Species of Wild Animals CMSCOP 13, was held on February, 2020 in Gandhinagar, India. The South Asia Future Earth Regional Office, the Devecha Centre for Climate Change and the Indian Institute of Science have released Our Future on Earth 2020 report. The report has been prepared with the aim of reducing carbon footprint and halting global warming below 2 degrees Celsius by 2050. Future Earth is governed by the International Science Council ISC, the Belmont Forum of Funding Agencies, the United Nations Educational, Scientific and Cultural Organization UNESCO, the United Nations Environment Programme UNEP, the United Nations University UNU, the World Meteorological Organization WMO, and the Science and Technology in Society STS, Forum. The Union Cabinet has approved the Medical Termination of Pregnancy MTP Amendment, Bill 2020. The bill seeks to extend the termination of pregnancy period from 20 weeks to 24 weeks, making it easier for women to safely and legally terminate an unwanted pregnancy. Supreme Court of India has ordered for permanent commission for all women officers in the Indian Army. The Supreme Court declared that Short Service Commission SSC, women officers are eligible for permanent commission and command posts in the Army irrespective of their years of service. The order extends permanent service for women and makes them eligible for ranks, pensions and promotions. It also marks a milestone in the decade-long legal fight. The move is a step closer to gender equality and supports by providing female soldiers with the same opportunities and benefits as their male counterparts.